Greetings, Couch Potatoes! I'm Dude Long Couch. Welcome to my Let's Play of Uncharted 4. So guys, I'm a pretty big fan of Uncharted. I should say I'm a pretty big fan of Uncharted 2. I've played all three of them, you know, the main titles that were on PlayStation 3. 2 is by far my favorite. I thought 3 was okay, but it had some problems. And 1 is just kind of what it is. But I've been hearing from a lot of people that Uncharted 4 is the best of the bunch. Apparently it's even better than 2, and it's getting really good reviews from almost everybody except IGN, but who cares what IGN thinks. One other thing I want to note is that I would have had this video up sooner, but the United States Postal Service was too busy sucking every last dick in the universe to actually deliver my game on time. But it's here now, let's get started. Story Mode New Game Challenge Level Five different difficulty modes, that's a lot. Let's see, Explorer. You want the story and adventure but aren't interested in the challenge from combat. Camera and aim assistance settings are enabled by default. That's like the only one they bother explaining. Oh, Crushing. Okay, this mode is intended for players who want an intense challenge in combat and are experienced with the controls. I don't know. Let's go middle of the road. Lock on, aim off, camera assist off, all this stuff. We'll just leave it off because that's the default. We can certainly always make adjustments later, should we need to. I am a man of fortune, and I must seek my fortune. Henry Avery, 1694. Who's Henry Avery? Nobody knows who that guy is. Okay, we're in control of the boat. This is gonna go great. I'm a natural sailor. Alright, we've got camera control. Nice. R3 resets. Alright, let's get up to ramming speed. Ah, oh, yeah! Come here, bitch, you're next on my list. Oh shit! Can't catch this guy. Oh, I missed him. There we go. I don't know who Sam is, but you better start hitting some shots, dude. Dude, I have the best boat in the world. Oh! That's foul! Don't let him get in front of you! Okay, okay. We won't let them get in front of us. Wait, where's the island? I gotta head for the island. I've lost sight of the island. Oh shit! Did I fail? Okay. <laughs> Yee! I guess that was supposed to happen. Oh, now I'm probably drowning. Okay. What happened to Mega Boat? Come on. What did I okay, okay, oh shit. Must shoot people, must kill them all. Oh, that was awesome. Damn it. 
More coming. I might have to lock this sensitivity down a little bit. Sam, how's the engine? Oh, I thought that was a headshot. Damn it. It's hard to aim steady when the boat is rocking. There we go. Yeah, yeah, I got it. We're good. Yeah, come on. Get us out of here. How did the boat just know to drive away? <laughs> All right, on the move again. Straight to the island. Mega boat, protect us. Take it. Cross. Get ahead. You can barely see out there. Yeah. Shit. Get them off of us. Splitting the D. I oh, I bounced off it. Seriously, who made this boat? <laughs> it's like, it's just, it's just like the juggernaut, man. On your right. Watch it, watch it. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Thank God. They brought a better mega boat. <laughs> Nathan. Nathan. What are we going to do with you? You must be tired of these lectures. I know I'm tired of giving them. And now you have to stay here with me all weekend instead of going on the retreat with everyone else? I don't care. Yes, that is the crux of the problem. I don't see why I'm the only one being punished. Because you started the fight. You wouldn't give me back my book. I told you to leave those books in your room. You only have yourself to blame. Doesn't give him the right to just snatch it from me. Does that give you the right to start throwing punches? It wasn't just about the book. What was it then? Nothing. I'll save it for confession. No matter what I try, you seem insistent on going down the same sad road as your brother. What a waste. I have a brother? That's new. We're in control. Chapter 1, The Lure of Adventure. So this is interesting. I'm pretty sure they already did the whole flashback show Nathan as a kid thing in Uncharted 3. I don't remember a ton of it, but I guess they're going back to that well. <laughs> and apparently I have a brother too. I'm pretty sure they've never ever made mention of that before, so that must be like a new character. But in any case, it doesn't appear to be much in here. I can zoom in. We got our boy Jesus up there. We got some books. World history. Mayan civilization. Yeah, so his whole thing is that he thinks that he's a descendant of the famous explorer Francis Drake. The Dragons of Mulgoria. And <laughs> I don't remember if that's actually true or not. I think they, like, they proved or disproved it in one of the games. I think they might have disproved it. I think he found out that that's not the case. But at this point in his life, he definitely believes it. So he's all obsessed with treasure and maps and geography and history and all the shit that ties in with that. All right, push forward, hit X to vault. I see you. All right, so he's signaling us. We got to get to him. So guys, if this is your first dude long couch let's play, there's something you should know about me. I am a habitual wall crawler. I like to find hidden stuff. 
And I don't know how it works in this game yet. In previous Uncharted games, there were, like, collectibles to find. They didn't do much for you. So depending on, you know, the reward for finding them, that kind of... And around we go. That kind of determines the intensity level of, like, how hard I'll look for stuff. But regardless, I like to just explore levels and see what kind of stuff I can find. That place looks like a thing that we could climb eventually. And right up here I see a climbing path to get up on that roof. Oh. Too slippery. I guess that's the way we're going right now. Also, if this is your first dude long couch let's play, welcome. Thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoy. If you're a returning viewer, welcome back. Thanks for the support. Basically, thanks all across the board. Thanks to everybody. <laughs> All right, we're going to jump back down here and slide on our ass. Wait. Oh, no. Oh. I wanted to get in the middle and see if there was, like, anything up there, but I don't think there is. Yeah, those shooting controls when I was on the boat, um, they were pretty gnarly. Like, the, they felt precise, but the, the sensitivity was, like, a little higher than what I'm used to. So I might have to lock that down just a smidge in order to not be terrible. It looks like they're leading me right up here with those white chalky lines, but I don't have the ups for that. Hmm. Alright. Okay, nice and quiet. We gotta be sneaky, sneaky. I always like to look at the mirrors in video games because my understanding is that it's extremely difficult to pull those off correctly. I'm not sure of like the technical reasoning, but I guess they just take a lot of like processing power and it's hard to like make a believable mirror in a video game. It's kind of cool. We can't go in there. These environments are very detailed. I wouldn't expect anything else from Naughty Dog. I wonder if there are actually people who could find me. Uh -oh. Isn't it our job to help boys like him? In the meantime, I'm neglecting the other dozen boys under my care. <sighs> what do you want me to do? You know my opinion. <laughs> I'm not ready to give up on him yet. You can't keep avoiding it. <clears throat> Look, I'll talk to him in the morning. Okay? <sighs> Good night, Father. Good night, Sister Catherine. She's coming back this way. Oh, good. She turned. Okay, we're good. I have heard that the stealth system in this game is a little bit more fleshed out than it's been in previous entries. Which excites me. I like stealth in video games. I'm not, like, you know, exactly great at it. <laughs> but I enjoy it. What have we here? Whoa. It's my file. Read, zoom, mm. put away. Interesting. So I guess we can go in and read the actual writing, or we can just hit square. St. Francis Boys Home, Behavioral Report Form. I caught a glimpse of Edward waving one of Nathan's books around, teasing the young boy. Nathan immediately leapt on Edward, knocking the larger boy down. I ran over to separate the boys, but not before they both managed to pummel each other. Administrative signature, Father Ryan Duffy. Huh. So it was like I said, the kid was being an asshole, and he got us just desserts. Alright, I guess that wasn't exactly a collectible. But I'm glad that we looked at it. That looks like the way we're supposed to go. That means I've got to explore over here first. That might be a bad idea, though, because she's standing right there. Press to take cover. Okay.
There's got to be a reason. Oh, L3, look. Got to get to that window. Oh, I guess that's the way I'm supposed to go. Never mind, I want to go back Come now. On. Move it, sister. What the hell is she doing? What is she? Oh, she's smoking. <laughs> Sister, you has a secret. Keep looking that way. Oh, I can't try this door now. I probably just would have been locked anyway. All right, we got to sneak past her. I can do like a tuck and roll thing. Okay, L and hold circle. That's how we stealth around corners. Okay. Bad timing. Bad timing. The worst timing. Nathan. Oh, she got me by the ear. Trouble. <laughs> okay. I actually did that on purpose, believe it or not, because I just kind of wanted to see like what the consequences were for failing. And turns out there's not really any. And I hope that the game is always that liberal with its checkpoints. Alright, so let's wait. No one is here. Everything's fine. Here we go. Sister Catherine? Oh shit. Catherine, I've forgotten my keys again. Can you open the gate for me? Coming, Father. All right, guess now's my chance. I'm coming. Even at this age, I've got mad parkour skills. I'm making a lot of noise out here, though. Sam, hold up. Okay, come on. The weird camera angle made me go back the other way. This is the story of this guy's life. Everything he climbs on falls apart. Sam? Where'd you go, you little creeper? Ooh, you gotta learn to watch your back. <laughs> All right. Hey, it's good to see you, little brother. What was that? Really? Again? It's nothing. You told me you'd stay out of trouble, though. He was talking shit about us. So? He said that Dad dumped us here because we're worthless, and Mom is in hell because- Nathan, Nathan, come on. They're just saying it because it gets to you, all right? You just gotta learn to laugh it off. You wouldn't. Well, do as I say, not as I do. <laughs> here. You'll catch cold. So- what are you doing here like this anyway? If the nuns catch you, they're gonna call the cops. Well, I got something for you, and I couldn't wait till Christmas. What? It's outside. What happened to us staying out of trouble? Uh, this is an exception. Mm-hmm. <laughs> now you jump. <laughs> Come on. Yeah, give me a hand. Hold on, I gotta look around first. Ah, oh, there's nothing here. All right. The sister's feeding you enough. <laughs> that place is kind of empty. Where is everyone? Some Bible retreat. Yeesh. I remember those. Sounds boring. Yeah, so like I said, I'm fairly certain that this dude has never been mentioned before. I think they just invented an older brother for Nathan just for this game. <laughs> Seems like an alright dude. 
Give me his coat. He's the one decent guy in there. You should come and say hi. Nah, I don't need the guilt. <laughs> Catholic guilt. So can I do a back jump? Yeah. This way. That was fun. Damn. You didn't prop it. I, I, I did. No, you didn't. At least I thought I did. No, it doesn't matter. We're gonna take the high road. The high road? Just follow me. Watch this. Whoa. And now, we take the high road. The road less traveled. Have you done this before? Uh, once or twice. Oh, here, come on. Your turn. I like it. We're like Batman. If he had just a crappy rope instead of like an actual <laughs> mechanized thing. You have to hold L1 to climb. That's weird. So what happens if I don't hold L1? If I don't hold L1, I can't move up or down. That feels really odd to me, control-wise. There's probably a good reason for it. I just don't know what it would be. Just yet. So, what you been up to? Working mostly. You still dating that girl? Oh, uh, Crystal? Oh, on again, off again. Currently off again. So that's a no. Where the hell are we going, anyway? <laughs> I want to climb that clock. No guts. No glory. Ugh. Hey, is this where I was before? When I was trying to get in the center? I'm not sure. I'm coming. Oh shit. Just don't think about it. You got this. Alright. I got you. See? No big deal. Yeah. Nothing to it. Stay with me. These kids should be in the circus. Like, why am I in an orphanage? I could be making, like, millions of dollars right now. Pretty cool, huh? Yeah. Totally. Jump. Oh, I have to jump up and climb. I was trying to just jump straight across. Right behind you. Alright. Push towards goal. Press circle to crouch. Okay. Whoa. You don't just crouch. You do a tuck and roll. Coming up. Okay. Okay. Right down the middle. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. Wonder if I should try and tuck and roll on here. There's no tactical reason for it, but it would look cool. I can't do it. <laughs> Was that a sin? I think that's a sin. Hey, here you go. I don't get that joke. You said it was a sin? Oh, because we were on the cross. I get it. <laughs> you ready, Tarzan? Oh, boy. You want me to do this? All right. Yeah. All right, go ahead. Okay. That was easy. I'm pretty sure I did that better than he did. I landed on the surface. He had to grab the edge. Up the steeple. Come on. Alright, it's a little finicky about wanting to let you jump. 
Why isn't this working? I can't jump that high. I just go around the corner. Oh. All right, here we go. Amateur path. It's a nice view, huh? Yeah. <laughs> Not bad. You ever been up here before? This particular route? No. But you do know where you're going, right? Eh, more or less. That sounds like more of a less. <laughs> you wait here. And you watch me. Ooh. Your turn. All right, here we go, guys. Better right. not screw this up. Just don't overthink it. Oh. Oh, ah. Gotcha. Come on. Ah. Ah. I did it. Yeah. Of course you did. These kids are nuts. Could you imagine somebody actually doing that in real life? <laughs> Follow me. How about you take this one? Okay. Really? Yeah, really. I'll follow your lead. Press L1 to throw. Dude, do I actually get to grapple myself? Like, okay. Atta boy, Nathan. Nice. And then we just walk off the edge. Oh, that said, while reaching, it's safe to jump. Okay. Okay. That's a nifty mechanic. I wonder, like... There's probably predetermined spots I can do that, though. All right. After you. Oh, are we going down now? Are we done with the climbing? No, head down. Just like that, we're out. All right. Check it out. Huh? Whoa, <laughs> you got the 250? 250? What are you talking about? No, this is the 500cc twin. No way. Yeah. Where'd you lift it from? Whoa. That's a low blow. But hey, I'll have you know that I am a changed man. Bought this with hard-earned cash. Here, come on, take a seat. What? The only time you pull a stunt like this is when you're trying to make up for something. You are too smart for your own good, you know that? All right. I got this job. Pays well. Really well. But, uh, I gotta leave town for a little bit. What's a little bit? Uh, like, uh, a year. At the most, and then I'll be back before you even know it, all right? You're bailing on me. Come on, don't be so dramatic. What, so it wasn't bad enough to leave me in that place? How could you do this to me, Sam? Hey, wait, I'm doing this for you. The money I make is for the both of us. And then in a couple of years, couple when you're out... years? Take me with you. I, I can barely support myself. I'll pitch in. I know you think the orphanage sucks. You have no idea. Yeah, but it's the best thing for you right now. All right? You just gotta trust me on that one. It's not fair. Hey, nothing about our lives has been fair. But we've made it work, right? Sure. Well, you know, the bike wasn't the only surprise. And I guess I'm gonna have to ruin the next one. What? I found Mom's stuff. Everything that Dad sold, I tracked down the buyer. If you're saying this just to make me feel better... Uh -huh. I swear to God. Where? Yeah. On the other side of town. What do you say we go and get it back? You mean steal it? Yeah, it's not stealing if it was ours to begin with. 
I'm pretty sure the cops aren't gonna see it that way. Well, then let's not get caught. You ready for this? Hell yeah. Estar más fácil de lo que esperaba, eh. You're gonna have to do a better than that, pal. Acabemos con esto. Let's go. Fisticuffs time. Ooh, okay. La paliza. Chingada, este gringo sabe pelear, eh. <laughs> Alright, dude, let's do this. Escape struggle. Oh, nut shot. Ow. Do I have a dodge or something? Or a block? Okay. Fuck. Fuck. Ow! I'm getting my ass whooped, guys! Hey, get your ass down there! Ooh, oh! Oh! I got you now. Come on! How are we both not dead yet? <laughs> Oh, that was good. I'm gonna die. My turn. Yeah. If we weren't fighting, huh? Right, little guy? Hey, give me a call when you're tall enough to ride the rides. Solitaria. Cállalo. So I guess I'm in like a Mexican prison now? That was a really weird scene change. <laughs> How long am I supposed to be in here? Huh? Where's the toilet? You're looking at it. Have fun. I will. Gracias. Dream too. Hey, hey, hey. All right, easy. Ah. All right, calmate. Damn, these guys are so friendly. All right, guys, well, we made it to chapter two. That's the intro of Uncharted 4. So far, I would say this game is all about how much it sucks to be Nathan Drake, but it seems pretty good. <laughs> the story's, like, uh, actually pretty interesting with, like, the, the older brother and the random weird scene change that we're now in some kind of Mexican prison or whatever. I don't, I don't even know. But I'm, you know, interested to see where it goes. So, thanks for the support, guys. I'm Dude Long Couch. Catch y'all in the next part. See ya.